Today, I want to show you how to make a classic Sichuan street snack called dan dan noodles. Dan dan mian. Unlike other dan dan noodles, this one is going to be a vegetarian recipe. Topped with a handful of semi savoy spinach, zucchini, and mixed with my homemade hot chili oil based sauce. One clove of fresh garlic, sliced and finely minced. One stalk of scallion. Leave the bottom behind and only chop the green leafy portion. For toppings, wash half bunch of semi savoy spinach. Remove the ends and divide it in half. Two heads of zucchini, slice ends off. Make diagonal cuts that are no thicker than an eighth of an inch. Then, julienne. Dice three tablespoons of fully pickled mustard, aka jia cai. Jia cai is a preserved Chinese mustard well known in the Chongqing region. You'll see other dandan noodles using ya cai, a pickled vegetable. Because I'm not going to use meat, I've replaced Sichuanese ya cai with pickled mustard. Both are crunchy, thus give different flavors, yet equally fragrant and delicious. Next, roast half teaspoon of Sichuan peppercorn at medium heat. Once that's roasted, transfer to a mortar and pestle to crush into powder. This paired with hot chili oil will give you the famous Sichuan spicy numbing sensation. In the same wok, add 4 tablespoons of low sodium soy sauce, 1 tablespoon of sugar, 1 fourth teaspoon of kosher salt, One eighth teaspoon of MSG and one fourth teaspoon of white peppercorn powder and mix well. In a bowl, add one tablespoon of sesame paste, three tablespoons of my homemade spicy chili oil. If you haven't seen it and you are interested in making this recipe, I'll drop the link in the description below. I'm adding mostly chili oil rather than chili flakes. Thai chilies are extremely spicy, so too much won't be tasty. Now, toss in the Sichuan peppercorn powder, preheat it sauce, and give it a gentle mix. Boil a pot of water. Add a teaspoon of kosher salt. This helps to flavor the noodles. When water boils, add two bunch of fresh wonton noodles. These can be found at your local Asian market. Let it boil for five minutes. Then transfer to a bowl of cold water to prevent noodles from being too sticky. If you find my videos are helpful, Feel free to like and subscribe because it helps me tremendously. I publish new recipe videos every other Thursdays. If you see something you like but not sure where or how to start, leave a comment behind and I'll look into it for you. Gather spinach in a strainer. Dip into water to cook. Take it out after 30 seconds. Place zucchini in a strainer as well. Dip it into water. Stir with chopsticks to ensure everything is evenly cooked. Once zucchini starts to bend, it's ready and take it out. Do not overcook, otherwise it will change the entire texture of this dish. Now that you have all the ingredients ready, pour sauce into a larger serving bowl. Add noodles on top. Then, spinach and zucchini.
sprinkle minced garlic, jia cai, scallion, and gently pour another tablespoon of hot chili oil on top to finish it off. There you have it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.